against the Pichu came in clutch against Fred, but I still weren't expect to see it. Especially with how good Master is at just destroying stocks. I wouldn't want to be such a light character. It could be that, but like who knows, that lightweight might like Palutena is a more universal weight than Pikachu. And then Pichu. Yeah. But granted, Pikachu Pikachu has been known to notoriously lose that matchup because, like, that up smash covers everything Pikachu wants to do. But it's going to be interesting for Pichu because it's lighter, faster. But it, he's using Palu. He just wants to use that Nair. Yeah, like I was saying, I expect to see the Palu on Battlefield here for game number one. I feel like this is going to be a great stage pick for both of them. Mm -hmm. It will get such long combos here. Master, obviously, very comfortable with these rising up airs on the platform. Yeah. And, like, he can lead those rising up airs into death combos. Ooh, down throw. Oh, up throw. Into. Just went for an up B. Up air, up B. Trying to go for the cleaner combo. Nothing too fancy right now. And so, we got Dragneel. He has Master in disadvantage, but not really going to be able to do much out of it. Hitting with a fair to bear. Ooh. I Master went pretty low. I thought he, I thought Dragneel could have gone for it. Yeah, Dragneel doing a good job of just keep it even spacing with the backers. It's invincible, and it's good range. Mario uh, obviously always had problems with these characters that outrange him. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, that worked out. Good for him. Mm -hmm. Dragneel taking the first stock here. Yeah. Ooh, that dare would have definitely killed him. Oh, definitely. There. Oh, didn't go for any more. No, instead reads the spot dodge, gets the backer afterwards, but still gonna put him in a bad spot. Oh, uh, I I wouldn't have hit that angle. Yeah, for real though, that was like the clean, that was like the perfect one. That yeah, empty up spot, die. but a good response from Master Mario, gonna even out the stocks here. Oh, drag down up there. Huh? That is a weird one. I feel like I don't see that one from Kali's too often. Sometimes it kills. No, but I think it kills at like 180. That's what yeah. I heard. It it kills kind of late, like. But, you know, if you're not in back row, then why yeah. not? Either way, interesting to see it at such a low percent. Yeah. Usually people go for, like, the down throw, go for the nares after. Exactly. Oh, if he did not air dodge away, he might have died. Oh. Getting with the water, just trying to keep him at disadvantage. Fireballed in there. Trying to space him out, trying to hit each other with bears, but Mastiff getting the grab. Ooh, no two frame with that dash attack though. Off stage. Ooh, I like that option coming in from Dragneel. I feel like. Wait, does that move like auto fix itself? The explosive flame? Like if it's uh, supposed to hit a floor, it will just hit the floor. When you're using side B. Like it won't hit into the stage. I kind of get what you mean, but like sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. Because like I feel like it'll, it'll never go through the stage. It'll either go before or it'll go on top of the stage. It's such a weird mechanic, like how that move would work. Like how they programmed it, you know? All right. Here, there's a bear. That's going to take up the stock. Yeah. All right. Even game here. Last stock a piece on game number one. It's loser semi, so it's going to be a best of five, I believe. Mm-hmm. Up bear. We went for the drag down up bear, trying to get a reset on it. But Mass is not falling for it. He's just jumping out. Down throw. Oh, a little greedy. I like that. He jumps over the fireball, uses the back air's invincibility to break through Master's approach. Mm -hmm. He's playing this incredibly patiently, exactly what you want to see against a player like Master. Yeah, fair. No. No. He, oh, he burnt his double jump. He couldn't make that one connect. Yeah. Uh, he's waiting him out. Yeah, uh, Dragneel throwing out these options, just trying to like space him away. I like the. He's been. He hasn't been reusing that auto reticle as much as I've seen other Palutena's do, right? <laughs> I am Massa looking for the edge guard right here with the flood. Runs off with the nail, but it's not gonna connect. <laughs> oh, miss out on the up air. Not gonna. Not gonna try to close out the stock greedily. Ooh. That was dangerous. Massa throwing out the forward smash, just pressuring Dragneel right now. That was a interesting option. Yeah, I feel like. Oh, there's oh, the bear. There it is. Down tilt to bear. True. It's, I'm pretty sure that's true. Yeah. Like, it's like that raw bear is just such a fast option. Mario's options in this game are ridiculous. Mario's a good character. Like, I know. Like, the he's able to 
He could start off his jump with an up aerial, lead into a combo. He could end his jump with a. He could do a landing up aerial. It's safe. He could grab after it. He could bear. He could throw out two bears in the same jump in the same short hop. This, uh, this character is good. I think we're all on that on that train that Matt, Matt Mar is a pretty good character. I th I feel like he's top ten. Maybe yeah, he's top ten for sure. What about you? What do you think? There's twenty characters in the top ten. Twenty characters in the top ten. Yeah. All right, so yeah. Master getting the up throw into the Dare Gang and up here follow up and he leads the air dodge, gets another up here but not gonna get another punch. <laughs> Down throw into the Pharaoh, gets a dash tag afterwards. Dragneo keeping the percent in his favor. Up air, up air. Oh, went for the fair immediately, but nice tech coming in from Dragneo. Oh, oh no. no! Oh, good oh. DI away, honestly. Like, that was a scary spot to be, but like, DI's away, makes it so Master can't follow in. Yeah, he went for the... He went for some crazy stuff right there. That was uh, pretty risky. Like, I mean, it was, uh, it was very patient, and, like, a lot of people would have been kind of scared and, like, Actually, he was kind of going for the I won't, they won't press a button option, you know? And if you like, oh, oh no. he caught okay, his... he has his jump. Good stuff. I, I thought he was dead. All right, Master with the back here forcing Dragneel away. Oh, he caught that, his jump. No, wow, great angle once again from Dragneel. He's got all of those on deck. Man, that, that guy has the notches on point. Going for the fourth throw, getting himself some advantage, uh, getting him an advantage state again. Running back and forth, down tilt. Oh, missing out on that nair. Mm. Oh, I like the forward smash. Yeah, just catches him jumping onto stage, gonna be able to end that stock. And what an aggressive option, Master charging the up smash under him, and he lands with the back and makes it work. Yo. Yeah, that's a thing. <laughs> That's 75% on Master. Oh, Master's being very aggressive. Nice snare coming in from Dragneel. Dragneel playing a, playing a really good this game. He's dead though. Yeah. All right, Master needs to kind of collect himself a little bit. It, he's like holding forward into Paluan. That's the last thing you want to be doing. Yeah. That up air nearly killing. Now we're playing a... Uh, very patient game. He rolls, but he's dead. Yeah. Just barely, though. Yeah. Dragno playing incredibly well. Up a full stock over Master and on the FD transformation of Town and Say here. There's not a lot Master can do to get an early star. Mm hmm. And that, oh, went for a dash attack, but Master not flinching. Up there's coming in. He's juggling him. Nearly still going on the aggressive. All right. Nice re-grab. Going for the double fair. Bear? Oh, that was an opportunity. He had the air dodge. Could have gone for a dare. But that, that would be ballsy. Yeah, Master's really just struggling to find an opening that'll make a difference here against Dragneel. Going for the teleport. Immediate. Doesn't get the run up detail. Good time. Mm -hmm. Get up attack from Dragneel. Gonna keep him alive. Oh, there's the force. All right. Master, 108%, he has the lead. If the platforms come back soon... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's exactly where Master wants him, above that platform so he can get an early stock with it. Down, Down throw, throw, up air, up air. Oh, can't Doesn't get the, get the platform. Uh-oh. Oh, no, he no, got it now. don't air dodge there. And that Death. is it, Master. What was that? Oh, man. That was highway robbery. <laughs> Good God. And like I said, as soon as the platforms come back, Master turned it up to 11 right there. Mm -hmm. Indeed, indeed. Dragneel definitely felt like he had that game. But he just, he got, once Master Mario had his transformation, the transformation he wanted, Dragneel kind of like went at him, was a little aggressive for that stock and got punished heavily for it. And actually opting to go Pichu instead of Palu for game three. I, I don't know about this, but Paolo was looking so good for so long. Yeah. Mm. Nair's just getting uh, getting some clean damage in. But this is gonna be this is really risky because Pichu is light and can like I'm pretty sure. But another thing is Pichu's so small 
I, it's going to be a bit harder for Master Mario to get these landing up airs. Like, yeah, and the other thing is they're going to be playing kind of the similar neutral with the T-Jolts and the uh, Fireballs, where they're going to throw a projectile out and then jump in behind it. Mm -hmm. uh, the only difference is it's going to be damaging Dragneal either way. Yeah. But if Dragneal gets him with uh, with just the the ball, yeah, it could put Master Mario on a tripping animation. He could die for it. I going yeah, for the bear. Shield. Teach you the true glass cannon. He could die. He will die to practically anything. Back throw. Oh, nice di. Almost dying for it though. Oh, nice stuff coming in from Masta, realizing he was going to go for the Thunder Jolt. A lot of Peachy's like going for it. Oh, hoping it was going to roll away. I hey, roll in. Alright, Masta looking really confident right here in this game number three. 44% already on Dragneo's second stock. Down throw into the back here. He's going to look for the two frame with the dash up, but he's not going to find it. Keeping the pressure on oh, both of them man. going for smash attacks. And like that barely whiffed them too. I, like, they were just outside of each other's ranges. And there's a forward throw. Oh, caught him That's with it. the... No jump. Caught the jump. Like, it was, like, right at the bottom of the blast zone. That bottom, uh... That bottom part of the... The offstage on the bottom part of Town City is, like, non-existent. Oh, that was a dash attack. I mean, that was a jab right there. Could have been the stock. Oh, Massa poking through the ledge right there. Oh, there's a jab there's block. There's a jab block. Oh, got the sour spot. Back throw, not gonna kill. Nearly killing. Though. Almost. Ma pretty much max rage here on Mario. 70%. This is very dangerous for future. Good angle, but man. I'm pretty sure Drag Nil. Wishing he could have gone Paolo. Maybe. You know what? I feel like at the end of the day, the Paolo didn't win a game at all. Yeah. So you're thinking, okay, it was close. I. Uh, oh. Unfortunate. That was pretty anticlimactic. Yeah. <laughs> okay then. <laughs>